at the end of this video you will also able to learn how to customize angular material dead picker module css so stay tuned hello everyone welcome to quick code academy today in this lecture i will show you how we can customize the uh, mat calendar of angular material so for that first of all we will need to import three modules mat dead picker module mat native date module and mat input module in our module.ts file so you can see over here i have added all the necessary modules and the app.component.html i have added input then mat dead picker toggle and mat dead picker so if you see the output over here i'm getting output like this first for some reason if you don't want to use uh, these colors and you need to customize the css of that so it is very hard to do so what we can do we can just uh, click ctrl shift i and over here we will check what are the classes available for the dead picker so over here first i will select on mat calendar and here i will try to change some properties so here now if I say background color linear gradient so from 45 degree let's keep it as it is now and from orange to red if I keep then we will get the output like this one so we will have to uh, copy this CSS styling so I'm copying it so I will paste it in my CSS file and in your case that may be CSS file so along with the styling property we will also need the class for that so over here the class is mat calendar so I, I will have to copy that one as well so I will add the class mat calendar and within curly braces I will add background color like this one okay so now if i see the output again on the browser this won't reflect because whenever you want to override any uh, css so at that time you can make use of ng tip so here if i say ng tip and now if i try to check that one so you can see my colors has been changed so let's uh, do some other changes so here i don't want this label as black so here i need to make it white then what we can do we can see over here for the td tag we have the matte calendar body label so we will try to change that one in the similar way what we can do we can give color as white step by step we will try to override some of the properties here we should put dot since it is a class and now let's check so now you can see this month has become white so along with that we need to make this numbers white as well so for that we will have to check the class first so here i'm cl clicking on one so here i have got the class as mat calendar body cell content so we need to copy that Let's see I will put it over here and inside that we need to give color as white so for just demonstration purpose I am using the basic colors ok let's check on browser now we have to change this dates as well so here we have class as mat calendar table header 
so let's change that as well so in the similar way you can say ng tape so so i guess instead of doing this one let's try doing like this mm, let's see whether it works or not I think we have to explicitly mention that so let's copy this one control C let's remove this one here I will give ng tip let's check so now our header labels is also become white so now these two are remaining so for that let's check what is the class so over here we are getting mad button okay so i don't think that is the class we should override over here we have mat header as well so let's make change the color of it white okay so it is getting applied to so similar to this one we will have to use ng tip then let's make color as white for your understanding i will be adding all these classes in description as well make sure to check that one so now let's check whether it is reflected or not so only now this uh, drop down icon and these icons are remaining so let's change those as well so here i am getting mat calendar arrow so let's see whether we will be able to change that or not color is white I think that is not changed so let's see what's the issue over there so we have multiple classes over here let's see whether we can change this color no it is not getting changed over here i think they have given some borders so that is why we are not able to change those so i guess we have to change this border right and border left so let's copy this code from here and then paste it over here so and instead of giving transparent we can give as white right so let's check now no still not what is the issue here so let's check that let's check whether they have given color anywhere or not so over here I guess these things we have to change so I am just copying it so we can make border top color as white I think this will work so I think uh, how to make triangle you can check out that video as well because in that video uh, I have shown how to create triangle like this which you are seeing 
this arrow right so how to create arrow like this I have already uh, created one video on that maybe you can check that out so as of now we have achieved whatever we wanted so I think we have done good so far and let's change this border radius as well so how we can override that border radius border radius it's 5 px so now you can see this calendar has become some the corner radius has been changed so let's add this one in the CSS let's remove this extra okay now you can see we have overridden most of the properties of mat calendar so in the similar way you can achieve whatever ux you want by overriding css of material design so thank you all for watching this video if you found this video helpful make sure to hit like button and subscribe to my channel